Hey guys, how are you? Hope you guys are having a good, good Monday. <laughs> so I wanted to do a collective vocal channeling and maybe some collective messages just intuitively. So if you're watching this, this would be like part of a collective reading. So the first thing that caught up was willpower. A lot of you are putting a lot of time and effort trying to find out what is your willpower? What events can you manipulate into your being or what can you do to say thank you or to give back? And the simple like way to give back is not about racking up good karma or bad karma. It's more of a an experience, a purpose. And to say that is like, for example, you know you've done some bad things in the past and you know you're gonna do some community service or acts of you know random service to people because you're like, well, I did some bad. So I want to make up for it with good karma. A part of that, yes, it does work, but it's selfish intention. You know what I mean? It's like freely giving to yourself. But that also doesn't mean that you have to give away yourself. If that makes any sense, you have to keep giving away yourself. So that's what I meant by willpower is knowing when to stop and when to start and to choose your battles wisely. And if it doesn't align with your purposes, why you're choosing your battles, then chances are... You don't even need to be in that battleground even in the first place. So it's time for you to move on and change that playground or change the environment in which you are existing. So I wanted to say that. Um, okay, let's get into this, this channel. So Spirit, I invoke you with the highest of high intentions only for the soul. Um, any soul that resonates with this frequency, what frequency do are we are we channeling so please and thank you please come forward um messages that are intuitively given or spoken let them be of the highest truth please um so i'm seeing someone point like this like either you did something wrong or it's pointing you in a direction to be like watch out like stop doing this watch out like we're you know what i mean like they're truly trying to get your attention on that one centering and focusing mm. That frequency just reminds me of to be in your being. So maybe that is something for you to focus on your solar plexus and to live in the moment. Um, and knowing that your solar plexus allows you a lot of personal freedom if you use it and tap into it right. Because of the fact that this is a core battery or a core experience. A lot of us are going through things that are shifting our perspective and it's kind of throwing you off. So this is saying like that willpower to basically remain anchored and remain in a peaceful state of being is entirely, entirely up to you to choose to want it and to make it a reality. Mm.
that you guys don't see but every time i channel a frequency like this especially in a very high note like anything spiritual my dog is near so this is just like he's my eyes to keep me grounded in case there is something negative around me he will basically alert me to that channel changing frequency so he is a very good anchor he's also my spiritual protector my watchdog basically and so that's why i call him my little lion but um so that is what i got for you guys today and like you may actually ask me like what i'm staring at and the question is i don't know if it's gonna rotate but this picture right here of this woman i was staring at and i just kept thinking oh my god like that watching you know what i mean and i was like looking at that picture that i hit that frequency like that because i don't usually hit frequencies that hard like that so thank you so much for watching peace love and happiness and i hope that maybe this resonated with you in any space time continuum love you so much keep working on you love you